What's up guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I have decided to show you guys everything I eat today, bulking edition. Um, for the last two weeks I've been on this bulking journey and I'm trying to gain roughly around 10 pounds. My starting weight was around 144, 145 and I'm currently around 149. Um, so I decided I'll show you guys everything I've been eating because I've been just stuffing my face, trying to make sure I get enough protein, calories, etc. Um, so with all that being said, let's just jump right into breakfast because I'm starving. I have about nine pancakes and some strawberries, two fried eggs, and I'm going to go ahead and enjoy this and I'll see you guys when it's time for my next meal. Okay guys, so it is lunchtime and I have some white rice here. This is about half a cup dried that I'm eating right now. And then my dad made some oxtail, so I'm just going to eat that with the rice. See if you guys can 
see what's going on here. It smells so freaking good. I'm so excited. So I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy this for lunch and I'll see you guys when it's time for my next meal. Okay guys, it is dinner time and to be honest, it is the next day. I wanted to film this yesterday when I filmed the rest of this video, but my chicken was still frozen. So I could not cook it. Um, so I will have this for the next probably like three to four days. Um, so I'm gonna make some chicken thighs, boneless and skinless on the grill outside. Also gonna be roasting some broccoli outside. And for carbs, for me, I get two carbs because it's bulking. Um, so I'm gonna make some jasmine rice and these little baby potatoes and I'm just gonna roast these in the oven and make this in my rice cooker because it is God sent. Rice cookers are amazing. If you don't have one, please go get one. Um, and then I'm also gonna be making sweet potatoes and the sweet potatoes are not for me, they're for my boyfriend, but you will see me make them in the video. Um, I personally don't really like sweet potatoes. I will eat them if I have to. <laughs> Um, but they're not my favorite. So, but he loves them. So we're going to make it for him. Um, so I'm going to just prepare the potatoes, get the oven ready, put those in, and then I will show you guys the process of me making the chicken and the broccoli outside when the time comes. So as you guys see, after I cut the potatoes, I'm putting them in a bowl of what looks like water. Um, and that is because I like to put my potatoes, once they are cut, in cold water and salt. This way it draws out any excess starch as well as dirt. And it helps them from turning color if they're sitting out for a while. As you can see in the video, I had a lot of potatoes to cut because I did both the sweet potatoes and the regular potatoes. set it to 425 um, I'm gonna go ahead and clean the chicken and then season it and we'll bring it out making chicken I clean the chicken with um, apple cider vinegar and either lemon or lime I have a crap ton of lime so that's what I'm gonna do and I just squeeze the lime juice and throw the limes in there um, and let that sit for a little bit and then rinse season blah 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 all that good stuff but I just wanted to let you guys know how I actually clean my chicken because some people miss that step and that is not okay. But anyway, let's do chicken stuff. Okay guys, so I'm out in my backyard and it kind of looks like it's gonna rain, so we're gonna hope for the best. I'm wearing a glove to touch the charcoal because I don't want it all over my hands. Um, yeah, I'm taking you guys along on this journey because like I said, I've never done this before. This is my first time. As you can see, shaved my shirt. And we'll see how this goes. And hopefully it <laughs>
the charcoal. And now we just wait. So while I have to wait, because it's going to take about 20 minutes for the charcoal to get gray and ready for the grill, I'm going to go ahead and season my chicken, clean um, any excess fat and skin, etc. So. Okay guys, so this is what we have going on. Got the broccoli and the cast iron. I have some avocado oil and then I'll show you the seasoning that I use for the broccoli. And then on the chicken here we have paprika and then I'll show you the seasoning because I put the same seasoning on the broccoli. So this is the seasoning I used, don't mind my hands, they're really disgusting from this grill, um, but this is the seasoning I use and it is amazing. So I put this on the broccoli and on the chicken. And this is from Whole Foods. I also want to let you guys know that I had a protein shake after my workout which was just a scoop of protein with some almond milk as well as an everything bagel with avocado. Um, I had a full avocado on the bagel and I ate this after my workout. I just forgot to film it. So I finally finished cooking. It took forever but this is my dinner right here. I have some rice, the broccoli, potatoes, because I'm eating both potatoes and the rice, and two pieces of chicken, and I'm so excited for dinner. Um, so this is going to be my meal prep for the next probably like three days, and yeah, this is the end of what I eat in a day walking edition. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment down below. Let me know what your current diet looks like. And don't forget to like and su don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys don't miss any new content moving forward. I post every Wednesday and Friday. I hope everyone is staying safe and healthy and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!